This is what we call a laser dispersion interferometer. It's a laser-based diagnostic that allows you to measure average electron density in the plasma. So as the laser propagates through the plasma, the electrons in the plasma interact with the laser light, and you can measure this by looking at the phase of the laser that it acquires. And that information then is fed to the plasma control system. So this is like a very integral diagnostic to not only controlling the fusion conditions, but controlling the plasma itself. In the future, the fusion conditions are going to be even more extreme than we have now. But lasers, they're not really affected by those conditions or the, of the temperature. Um, and so this is one of the very few diagnostics that's going to be robust in the future to be on the fusion reactor and provide important information about plasma control and the density of the plasma. What I really like about fusion is that it's a very challenging field. And that's what makes it interesting. There's so many interesting problems and there's so many different ways to solve these problems. It gives you an opportunity to be very creative. This is a part of the technology development project. And what we're trying to do is we're trying to find innovative and new ways of addressing the various issues when it comes to operating diagnostics on the tokamak. And so it's not just that the problems are interesting, but you know these problems have an impact on the future. So that's what I like about working in fusion.